hello guys and welcome to this video in the previous video we run the demo code on the ePaper display and here I'll show you how to display an image on it so let's get started Uh, because the e-paper display hat is black, white, and red, I was searching for uh, an image uh, from Google about uh, the Sin City movie. I chose this image and uh, saved it uh, to my desktop, and after that I opened it in uh, Adobe Photoshop. Uh, now let's create a new document with uh, 176 pixel by uh, 264 height and click create let's go back to the image we downloaded uh, select all uh, the image by pressing ctrl a and uh, paste it on the new uh, created document now resize the image till you have the desired image size it looks good to me now uh, select all the image and go to menu image crop uh, that's crop uh, the image to the boundaries of our uh, document width and height select the red color area and right click select similar to select all the red color in the image then press Ctrl Shift J to isolate the uh, red uh, part in a new layer. As you can see, here is uh, the red part and here is uh, the black part. Now save the file and now let's separate uh, the image into two different files. Let's save the black part to black.psd. Uh, and then uh, the red bar to red.bsd now we are working with the red.bsd uh, let's select the red layer and uh, right click and choose blending option and color overlay it to black we want uh, we want this image to be one bit uh, bitmap so we must make it uh, all black and then we will tell the display to uh, display it in uh, red color now choose image mode and grayscale and flatten the image then choose image again uh, mode uh, bitmap press ok save it as a bitmap image uh, choose save as and then bitmap from the save as uh, type drop down then ok let's now do the same for the other image choose image mode grayscale and because this image have more uh, details let's choose image adjustments uh, posterize to and make uh, the levels of value to then click ok this will display the image without so much pixels around it now image mode uh, bitmap and save it as a, a bitmap now we have the images uh, ready I'm using WinSCCP uh, to log in to the Pi uh, this is uh, the same directory of uh, the demo files and uh, drag and drop the created uh, black and red images and, the re and then replace the existing one and the demo folder uh, choose main.by and right click and duplicate the file rename it as image.by and now edit the file I'll edit it using a sublime text and this uh, part uh, this one will display the shapes and the hello world demo text I deleted since uh, we don't need it and I want only to display uh, the image to display the image frame we need two buffers one for the black uh, white board and one for the red board then we will send it to uh, the display this is a very simple code uh, then save the file and close uh, sublime text 
open the terminal in Windows CCB and execute this command uh, know that we are in the demo code uh, folder and execute this uh, command python image.py here is uh, the image on the display and uh, it's now being uh, displayed Uh, finally, I would like to say to display an image uh, to this display, there is two ways. The first one, the direct method, which uh, is already explained, and the indirect way, which is you need to convert the image data into a C format using image to LCD uh, program, and you can find an example for this uh, in the Arduino code folder. I'll try to explain it in detail soon. So, uh, as I said, I got uh, many display sizes of this a paper and I'll play with them in Raspberry Pi and Arduino uh, I'd like to share uh, this project with you so please stay tuned and subscribe if you like the video please give it a thumbs up and if you have any question uh, please post it in a comment below ha um, I hope you like the video thank you for watching and have a great day